Hello, this is Jocasta Lester. In this video, I want to talk briefly with you about the um, the restoration oppression. Okay, so at work, I just want to tell you about these not so obvious um, setups of sorts, but not quite. Okay, some people, when they do things, it's no big deal. Um, you receive it for free and you just move on. Right? But some people, I've encountered and I've seen that they don't mean to give it to you and even though it may seem like it's for free now you can look forward to seeing them trying to take it back later <laughs> so not in all cases but some people are that I'm telling you so in this particular um, video I want to address a restoration um, oppression item so at work we were aboard the Apache and we went upstairs. He said, you want some coffee? I'm like, dang, you know, I'm like, yes. So we go up to the top of the ship and I came to realize that he didn't have permission to get the coffee. Um, he was going to the top of the ship, grabbing some coffee from the, uh, the ship people, <laughs> uh, ship force. And he was having it at his own discretion. So I asked one of the other ladies, um, is it okay to have coffee? And she said, oh, it's no big deal, it's coffee. Then she said, at your own risk. So I'm like, okay, here we go again. <laughs> because when it comes to, oh, it's serious. It's serious when it comes to me. But it's a joke when it comes to nearly everybody else, okay? So with that said, um, I just say, no, I don't want, I just don't want. So, <laughs> restoration oppression is one of those things where they make you feel like you can have it, no, you can't. And then years later or days later or weeks later, there's something that comes and it's thematic. You could tell that it has something to do with something that you got for free some years ago. I'm telling you. So, or right in that moment. So, I'm addressing this right now in this moment. I'm not crazy. I'm not paranoid. I've gone through some weird things, okay? So, and yes, you don't have to take it as somebody's, you know, being uptight. I'm not uptight. I'm the type of person where I'm just like, I don't get what the big deal um, when it comes to, you know, this is, except... There are people who feel like they've made you or that you owe them something anytime they do anything for you. Okay? So, with that said, um, if you don't believe me, look into um, he Abraham. He didn't want so much um, as a shoe latchet from those people. I didn't understand why. So, this is my... I don't want so much as a shoe latchet from them. <laughs> so, because I had coffee, I was like, mm, <laughs> this coffee doesn't feel so free. <laughs> <laughs> it just doesn't feel so free and I feel like I stole it so I'm like mm -mm, we're gonna fix this immediately and I don't know what that splash was but anyway <laughs> so <laughs> um the first thing that I did was put um one of their white cups on the counter with two dollars in it he had a cup and I had a cup it was Starbucks coffee that they brewed and I just left the two dollars in the cup I said I don't steal boom it was in the cup then I said you know I went to Walmart and I decided to do something I made a basket. <laughs> so, <laughs> this is how I feel. The reason why I don't accept anything from them is because of this, who I serve. <laughs> now, this is Taster's Choice. <laughs> this is, what brand is this? Caribou Coffee. <laughs> this is a uh, New England brand. I don't know what that, you know, it's, it's some coffee mate creamers in there. <laughs> So I think they have enough coffee for me to have restored them a hundredfold. So have a blessed and marvelous day. Repent for the kingdom of heaven is at hand. Um, I am in the process of restoring many ways. And I don't want anything to do with anybody saying that I stole anything from them. Or that they've given me anything that I didn't receive deservedly. So blessings to you and repent for the kingdom of heaven is at hand. Take care. Real friends are real friends. False friends are false brethren. And I don't want anything to do with false brethren. Take care.